gentlemen, welcome to Jomo Kenyatta International Airport in Nairobi. It is a great pleasure having you all on board and we look forward to good service to you again in the near future. Thank you and have a good morning. No, not that. We need our visa. Oh, we're going to need this for our luggage. Okay, okay. Yes, I'll bring that out. Finally in Kenya, let the adventure begin. I'm so excited. These guys have lots and lots of planes. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Let's go um, run the immigration check. 7927. Okay, everything feels beautiful so far. Mm -hmm. Now, the reception here is beautiful. Everyone is nice at the airport. I'm not even kidding. Everyone is absolutely nice from the policemen, the immigration officers. In fact, let me not talk about it. Babe, what do you think about the like officers here? We've spoken with two police officers so far and they were absolutely nice and friendly. They actually and... asked if we were YouTubers because I was with my camera. And then they're receptive to the cameras too. Yep. I think they are friendly and I think they know that oh their city is open to tourists so they are also welcome. Yeah, that, that's it. So we are just going to hold on and get our East Africa visa. Yeah. Um, we came with the paper but it turns out it needs to be stamped as well. So we are just going to wait for that. We are going to change some money too so that we can just head to the hotel, drop our box so and then... So I can job living. Yeah, so I can start exploring. Yay! Now we have money. <laughs> Now we have money. Wait, 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 wait. See, we have Kenyan shillings now. So we've changed about $100 and we got how many did we get? I have Kenyan shillings now. No, we raised your money. <laughs> Please, how much did you get? $400. I negotiated for $180 and I was giving $129. Yep. Okay. In total, like $400, how, much, how many did this you get? This should be, that's one, two, nine times 100. Okay, so in all, we were able to get 1,000, is it 12,900 Kenyan shillings? For 100 USD. Yeah? Yeah. Our passport is finally here. Hello. Uh, Anthony. Yeah. Great. You didn't know I was the one? I mean, if you knew I was the one. Yeah, yeah. So you, I saw the lady and the Oh, oh. great. Oh, Hi. Okay. Great. Hi. Good morning. Okay. Let me go. Oh. Get in. Thanks. There. Oh, yeah, thank you, sir. Okay. So just turn to the front there. Okay. Can you please put this inside the backpack? Thank you. All right. You're good, eh? Huh? Yes. Okay, so this is officially weird. I am sitting down where the driver is supposed to sit down in my country. Yeah. It's cool, actually. Babe.
We just arrived Cozy Hotels, Nairobi, Kenya. We actually had some delays coming here because the road is currently under construction. But the beautiful thing is that the construction will be completed around June 2023. I'll be exploring Nairobi actually. I have the Nairobi National Park on my list and some other nice places. I'm also going to give you a room tour of this room we are staying in and the price and everything you need to know. Yeah, so that's it. Let's get going. So we're heading to the Nairobi National Park entrance to pay the entrance fee. The entrance fee is $43 per adult. That's for foreigners. Yeah. <laughs> Adventure. <laughs> Let's do this. I'm really curious to see how big this place is that it takes three hours. Guess how much we paid for this Land Rover? It's plenty of money. <laughs> Eighty dollars, guys. Eighty dollars, and that's about ten thousand Kenyan shillings. My name is Nathan. So the whole park is around one hundred and seventeen square kilometers. Okay. And uh, we expect to see animals like the lions. We have rhinos, buffalo, zebras, giraffe, crocodile, hippos, so many species of birds and so many species of antelopes. So the park is split into two. We have the forest part where we are right now yeah. and forest is about 10% of the whole park. Then we have the grassland which is on the other side covering about 90% of the whole park. Yeah. And that's where we expect to see majority of the animals. What are the best times to spot animals? Mostly we we recommend very early in the morning okay. and late in the evening. Still, uh, at this hour, we are expecting to see a lot because this is time when animals go to take water. Okay. So right now we are going to go to the key places like uh, the watering points, that is the dams and rivers, Yeah. looking for these animals. Okay. Yes. All right, no problem. I hope I have fun. <laughs> you must enjoy. <laughs> elephant in Nairobi National Park okay but uh, we have the rhinos okay which are very close allies to them yeah I've heard about the big five yes the big five are here 
No, because the elephant is not here. Okay. Yes. So what animals are part of the big five? We have the rhinos, we have elephant, and we have the buffaloes. Okay. Then we have lions and leopard. Those oh. are animals. Yeah. Yes. Big five are the most hunted animals. Yeah. During those times. Do the animals attack people? Yes, they do. If you come outside the car, they will attack you definitely. Oh, but if you're inside the car, you are very safe. Yeah. You have nothing to fear yourself. Okay. Pardon? No. Oh. Telling her she has nothing to fear that she's safe. Ah, you are very safe. <laughs> but if you start walking around, then you, they also tell you like an animal. <laughs> you the food, and you know human being is the easiest catch. Right. Yes, you cannot box. You, can, <laughs> you cannot kick like a zebra. Don't have horns like buffalo. Ivory burning historic site. Yeah. So Ivory Burning Picnic Site is a monument yeah. where we celebrate the burning of the animal product. You see here we don't support ivory trade or yeah. any kind of material from the animal yes. for sale. So once we see them from either poachers, animals die naturally, they are normally being brought here for destruction. Yes. Because otherwise if you sell, then it's like you are supporting the trade itself. Yes. So for us we burn. Going to Carnivore, the guide that took us around the national park brought us to these um, local Kenyan restaurants and we just had food. Now there's a souvenir shop just beside the restaurant, so we want to check it out and see the things we can get from Kenya as souvenirs back home. Let's just get into the souvenir shop and um, I don't know what we're going to get, so let's see if we find something interesting. Yep. Point it at the camera. Me, I love Nairobi. Okay. So we just finished shopping at the souvenir shop and we got a giraffe. We got some fridge magnets and some other things. I think the first set of things we got amounted to 4,500 um, Kenyan shillings. Then the second one was about, is it 700? Yeah. Baby, is it 700? 800. Yeah, so that's it. That's how much we spent at a souvenir shop. All right, thank you. When are you checking out? Yeah, no, we're checking out tonight, actually. Uh, tonight? <laughs> we spent most of the day at Nairobi National Park. Okay. Kenya 
Kenyatta International Airport and we're heading for Uganda. I'll show you guys when I get to Uganda. That's going to be like a whole different vlog. So thank you so much for following me on this particular journey. Hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section if you did. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel and also click on the bell icon so that you can get notified of subsequent videos I will be putting out. Thank you so much once again. Bye. Thank you, enjoy the fight.